Hey, we're going to cover off entrance animations in Bricks Builder. Now, this is quite an easy one, but if you don't know about it, it's easy to kind of think, well, there's no entrance animation facility. Let me show you what I'm talking about. I'm going to go down over here to one of my sections or containers or even a block where I have an image. Now, this image is just an image. It just appears when you're viewing the page. When I say appear, it's on the page. It doesn't fade in or anything like that. If you click on the image and you go over to content, there is no option down here for you to do an entrance animation. Even when you go to style, you think, okay, maybe it's in a layout. And again, you scroll up and down and you're not going to find anything. You can mess around as much as you want. Some people have resorted to putting in CSS. Now, what I want to show you uh, is really, really simple. And once you know how to do it, you'll realize, ah, okay, I get it now. What you do is you scroll to the top and you'll see the interaction icon. This is from version 1.6, which you should all have if you're using Bricks Builder. You click this and it opens up a new pane. This is where we're gonna add in the interaction. I'm gonna click plus. Remember, we clicked on the image. The trigger for this, well, you can decide. Do you have to click or hover? Or maybe you just enter the viewport. Um, viewport is normally the one you would go for. So as you scroll up and down, this happens. You can also do leave the viewport. So as you're scrolling up, you can actually have it leave the area as well. But we're just going to go for an enter viewport now. And the action we're going to go for is start animation. You could go with show element. What that would basically do is it would just show it, okay? Or usually use that for showing a pop-up. But we're going to go for start animation. And the animation we're going to go for is, uh, by the way, you do have to scroll up and down to find the one you want. But I'm going to type in fade in uh, up, which is that one over there. Now, the animation duration is currently set to one second. Um, I'm okay with that. I might, I might want to make it slower. So I'm going to go with 1.5 seconds like that. And what about a delay? Do you want it to happen straight away? Or do you want it to kind of happen gradually? So I'm going to actually add in a 0 0.25 second delay because what happens is as you scroll down, it will, it will immediately start. And I want you to kind of have scrolled a little bit before it kind of, well, zooms upwards or whooshes upwards or fades in upwards. The target is going to be self and I'm going to say run this only once. Every time you come back to the page, you know, I mean, you could say that every time you return to the home page, it happens, then you don't want to be doing this. But I just want to say just do it once and that is fine. And that is it. And I'm not going to add any other conditions or anything like that. And, and that's it. Basically, we are done. I'm going to hit save. And here we are on our page. Now, remember, as we get down to, I think it is the section coming up right now. Did you notice there was a little bit of a delay there? Let me just refresh my page in case you didn't believe me. Okay, as we scroll down, okay, it won't start immediately. There's a little 0.25 second delay, and then it takes about one and a half seconds to fade up. You see that? And there's our entrance animation, and that's basically it. You could have sliding from the left, zoom in, fade in, up, down, however you want to do it. And just as a reminder, it's over here, interaction. So you can click on any of these icons. I could even go to, say, this particular text over here. Let's go and stick in an interaction. Sorry, let's click it. Let's hit the plus sign. This is going to be uh, <laughs> enter viewport. We're going to have show animation, and this time we're going to go for, we're going to go slide in from the left, and we're going to say the duration is, I'll tell you what, let's make it really, really slow. Let's go for uh, four seconds, and I'm actually going to say the delay now is a full second like that, and it's the self. That's it. We hit save. We go back over to our page. We just refresh that page, and look, you can see it there. Look, it's sliding in. I mean, I'll do it again from the top in case anyone doesn't believe me what it's doing. But watch this. As we come down, there's a bit of a delay there. I mean, it was overhanging. Now, I've got to make sure the container overflow is hidden. But can you see it took quite a while to slide in there? But that is the power of the interaction. I'm Imran Web Squadron. I hope you like, subscribe, share, and follow. I'll see you soon. Never break, always fight, never quit, do it right, play the game, win it life, have no shame, there's no time, feel the pain, let the grind, I could change, in my mind, pick a lane, commit and climb, the only way, to win it life, I never miss that fact, taking big swings, bitch, hand me the bat, put me in the ring, you'll go out in a bag.